I was on touch to this afternoon with Brandy Odom's relatives, and they tell us after burying the 26-year-old last week, their only hope now is for justice. Just a few minutes ago, detectives pulled several large bags of evidence out of the house behind me, and they are still searching for more. New today, the search for evidence intensified around this home in Rosedale, Queens. Early this morning, detectives moved in. Crime scene technicians suited up. They spent hours inside. This is where Brandy Odom lived with two roommates. Police have grilled those roommates about Odom's death. I'm kind of shocked that all of this is taking place right This woman lived directly behind Odom and her roommates. No, I haven't really seen anything out of the ordinary coming from the house. Other neighbors did see something suspicious. Police sources tell PIX11 the male roommate was seen backing his car into the driveway. Then he allegedly loaded large plastic bags into his trunk. It's a little strange on how he moved and how he did his vehicle and whatnot versus being outside forever and then not putting it in the yard. So, you know, then, then he knew something was wrong. That was right around the time when Odom disappeared. It's terrible that happened to her, and I hope they do end up solving the crime. Monday night, April 9th, Canarsie Park in Brooklyn. A dog walker made the chilling discovery. Brandy Odom's torso and her head. Her mother, Nicole Odom, returned to the park two weeks ago. She put up ribbons for her daughter's memory. There is now a $2,500 reward to help catch her killer. Killer or persons, if you seeing this, watching this, just please have some type of sympathy or heart and just come forward. Certainly some strong words from that mother. We just got off the phone with the NYPD a few minutes ago, and they say at this point, still no one is under arrest in the case. If you have any information they want to hear from you, you are encouraged to call the NYPD. Reporting live from Rosedale, Queens, Ayanna Harry, Pix 11 News. We'll